starting from the back of the ship. The collision, because lights are on, friction down to minimum, check the throttles. Bring them to maximum and then back to idle. Make sure that all the switches are in the proper position. Can you look at me? Yeah. Okay, bring forward, move transfer valve, balance pump, emergency bus, generator one and two, pitot hit, this is centered, all the switches are out. I will inspect all my displays. And then the upper part of the panel, this is on the right, this is off. Then I move up, make sure that everything is forward and the ultra brake is off. From there, we turn the battery switch on. Center my attitude indicator and make sure that my uh, system goes to its uh, built in test. I will turn the non echange charge and bus filter connect on. Stamps are live, and then there are the proper sources. Question. Take the fighter, inspect all the, the caution which are displayed on the, uh, on the present time. So, fuel pressure, engine oil, EP1, hydraulic, bypass, your generator, transmission, in on the right. On the second side, B2. Everything looks normal. We'll bring that to the uh, proper display. And normally, we would be uh, ready to start the system. So, there is a lot of possibilities of those systems. So, I can inspect the system page, for example, and look at the synopsis of uh, electrical schematic, for example, which tell me which system is power, which bus is. Uh, power at the present time. So everything which is in green is actually powered. If I turn the non essential bus off, for example, it's going to turn grey. And yellow. And back on. Okay, we also have the information of the system is actually uh, being displayed on. I can select another system for an automatic flight control computer. I can display my fuel weight and balance. Now the system is actually not active, but then when it will be active, the people will be able to enter the crew, the weight crew, for example, 300 pounds and so on. And at the end, the system, knowing which quantity of fuel is, uh, is being uh, on board, will be able to give you the weight and balance calculation directly. Okay, the uh, other pages are also available. Last accidents, for example, if the pilot or the crew has been doing some uh, exceeding some limits, it will be recording recorded on the display. Log data, regard the times and uh, everything which concerns the uh, flight time. We will be able, after certification, also to provide category A performance, power assurance checks, power performance. Now, this function is not available, it will be available after certification only. Going back to ACAS. So, on the main display, the pilot have a lot of uh, possibility as well. We can actually change the power setting, change the Decision 8 settings to different values. 
we can pre-select an altitude at which we'll be able to level off. This is can, this can be active on the way up or on the way down. We can change the ADC sources. Now, right now, we are using the left, the right side. This one, we're using the left side. And we're back to normal conditions. The source becomes not available, the triangle will become red. So this will be for our speed and altitude, but we can also do something for attitude indicators or heading indicators, heading sources. So we can also change the main navigation sources from FMS1, FMS2, VR1, VR2 or localizer 2 and back to FMS1. So two other knobs are for pointers, informations. Primary, VR1, localizer 2, FMS1, FMS2 and declutter. The third one will add the ADF to the list. The other possibility is our composite mode, basically, where we can uh, actually concentrate all the information on one display in case of failure of other displays. We can change the display to arc mode or to full map. To full arc, I can also select map. It's interesting when I'm using an FMS, for example. actually can change the range. Right now we're showing 80 nautical miles, so this is 20 nautical miles range. And I can see all the airports around my position. Now this is also, ava also available on center of the EU. And I can change the range. Let's go back to the page and we'll call tower to start. Tower zero zero two. Turns to start with the front side. Of the 